On the Great Falls Clinic Eye Cam, it's been a gorgeous day of weather. We have had a lot of sunshine around throughout the day today, and this sunshine is going to be sticking around for this upcoming weekend. Temperatures right now are below average. We're in the 20s and the 30s with the coldest temperatures along the high line. But even though it is chilly outside with that sunshine, it does make it feel pretty nice. There's also little to no wind around, which helps to make it feel pretty nice outside. And satellite and radar is nice and quiet right now. Nothing going on. And high pressure is currently in control of our weather, and it will continue to be in control of our weather for this weekend. So make sure you get outside and spend some time outdoors this weekend enjoying the nice weather while we have it. Taking a look at future track as we go through tonight, we are going down mostly clear skies. And just like last night, there may be some low level stratus clouds and potentially some fog along portions of the high line east of I-15. So just be aware of that if you are going to be traveling anywhere tonight. Heading into tomorrow, some fog around during the morning in locations east of I-15. But outside of that, you can expect mostly sunny skies during the day and it will be another dry day. Heading into tomorrow night, partly cloudy to mostly clear skies and there will be a few areas of fog around as well. And then heading through Sunday, we are going to have mostly sunny skies throughout the day and maybe a couple flurries along the Milk River Valley. But most, if not all, locations are going to continue to remain dry. The wind will start to pick up a little bit in some locations later on tonight, but the wind's really not going to be all that strong, generally between 5 and 15 miles per hour for your sustained winds. Heading into tomorrow, it will be a little bit breezy in spots, especially along the Rocky Mountain front, near the mountains in central Montana, as well as in Cascade County. That's where sustained wind speeds are going to be between 10 and 20 miles per hour, and a few gusts up to 30 miles per hour are going to be possible at times. But even though it is going to be a little bit breezy, the wind's not going to be too strong, and it is going to be coming out of the south, so it is going to be a warm breeze. Heading into tomorrow night, still a little bit of a breeze around in some locations, and then more of the same on Sunday. A little breeze around in spots, but overall the wind's really not going to be an issue at all as we go through this weekend. Tonight, it is going to be another cold night. Around the Helena area, lows are going to be in the single digits and teens, and then in north central Montana, most of us will bottom out in the single digits and teens, but some locations, especially from Hill County over towards Valley County, will get below zero overnight tonight. And then for tomorrow, high temperatures will top out in the 40s around the Helena area. And in north central Montana, most of us will top out in the 30s and the 40s. But along the high line east of I-15, it will be a bit colder with highs in the mids, upper 20s and low 30s. Heading into Sunday, another beautiful day of weather. But then next week, the clouds return, the cooler temperatures return. We are going to have a chance to see some snow showers, especially on Tuesday and Wednesday. In Helena, we are going to have very nice weather this weekend, then colder with some rain and snow showers possible for the middle of next week.